In this video, we will be learning a software called Cisco Packet Tracer. This is a very essential software because this software creates a real-time situations. Uh, it simulates real-time situations, which is a lot helpful to learn networking. And you can also find out what are the problems that could occur in a network. And you can also find the solutions for the problems. So. Uh, the download link for the Cisco Packet Tracer is given in the description below. You can go ahead and download your own copy of it. Okay, there will be two versions Cisco Packet Tracer Student and Cisco Packet Tracer Tutor, if I'm not wrong. So, you need to download the Cisco Packet Tracer Student version. On the bottom left corner of the software, you will find a couple of icons. So, these are the devices that we use in a network. There are a couple of devices over here. As you move your cursor over each of these devices, you can see its names. Um, we use routers, switches, hubs, wireless devices, connections, and a lot of other things. All these devices are used to uh, make two, two or more computers to communicate with each other. Okay, so when you click on the router, you have a couple of different versions of routers so the router which we will be using in the rest of the video is this generic router just click on the router and click on anywhere on the white screen and the router will get placed or you can just click and drag the router and you can place on the white screen so this is the area where we will be um, simulating real-time situations Okay, similarly there are switch in switch we'll be using a 2960 switch Okay, and uh, we won't be using hubs wireless devices Let's go to connections. There are different types of connections So we'll be looking at each types of connections later later videos and there is the end devices in the end devices you'll have your PC or the computer you have the laptop, you have server, you have printer, a phone, voice over IP phone, and a lot of other things. So these end devices are the devices um, where the uses, we uses normally use, like the computer and the TV, etc. So if you want to remove any device that you placed in the white screen, you got a red X button on the right hand side, it says delete. Click on that red X button and you can click on any devices you want to remove and the device will get removed. So that's how you remove something and you can also add or place a note in the screen just in case if you want to uh, remind yourself of something. So let's say I want to uh, say this is the router used to provide internet yeah and there you see so the note has been placed and this thing select over here it is used to move devices from one place to another or you can also move the text from one place to another so it's kind of a tool that is used to move and you can also move a couple of things together just click and drag and select whatever you want to move together and if you click on it you can drag it anywhere and place it anywhere in the screen so yep so these are the basics uh, with this let us proceed on to the next topic which we will be discussing in the next video thank you for watching